Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning, good morning, boys and girls. Good morning, boys and girls. I'm so glad you came to school. Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning, and I am so glad you're here, and I'm glad I'm here because we're going to have so much fun today. I cannot wait for all the fun that we're going to have. Go ahead and sit down because this morning we're going to do this fun paper. Look at this boy right here. He's dressed a little bit different than how we're dressed. What kind of boy do you think this is, Carter? What does he look like to you? Well, he looks like, Angelina, do you know what he looks like to you? No? Well, he kind of reminds me of those people that came over on that ship. And you remember that poem that we learned about in our last lesson, how they came over on that ship, but God protected them in the storm. What were those people called? The Pilgrims. The Pilgrims. See, you did know. It reminded me of the Pilgrims. And this is how they dressed back then when the Pilgrims came over from England to America. And he's wearing his special coat and he's got a belt. And then he has his little pants. Now, his pants are like little short pants, but they're not shorts. They're just pants that came down to their knees and then they wore long socks and they had those special shoes. And this is how the boys or the men dressed back then. So if you saw a man or a boy that looked like this, that was dressed like this, you would say, he is a pilgrim. So this is what a pilgrim looked like. And we're going to color this pilgrim together. Class, stand. Turn your chair quietly into the table. Boys and girls watching, you prepare as well. As soon as you sit down, you may take out your paper and get ready. Carter, pull your chair all the way over. That way your friend can get in. You can take out your crayons and put them right on your name tag. Wow, boys and girls watching, you are ready to go. Great job. Myla is ready to go. Catherine is ready to go. Good. Whoa, table three. Pat yourself on the back, table three. You are ready to go. I like it. Well, let's look right here at our pilgrim. His jacket is what color, Luke? What color is his jacket? Look at your paper. It is, it is blue. So I'm going to color with my blue crayon. I'm going to put mommy and daddy holding on tight. My babies are inside. Oh, I like when I turned around, I saw Johanna's eyes were right glued on me. She's off to a great start. Good job, Johanna. And I'm going to color my pilgrim's jacket's blue. Now, do you notice that he has a collar on his jacket? His jacket's collar is grayish. I don't want to color his grayish jacket part blue and I see he has some buttons what color are his buttons Cyrus yellow yellow so I don't want to color on his buttons either so I'm going to be very careful to go around his buttons and not color on his buttons now do you see how I'm going very careful I'm not coloring on his cuffs his cuffs of his jacket are gray too now am I finished coloring his jacket no. no, because I see he has a belt around his jacket, and then he has more of his jacket right there. So I'm going to color very carefully not to color his pants, or sometimes they call them knickers because they came right down to his knees. So we could call them knickers. There. And look how nice and neatly I did. I'm doing my best for Jesus this morning. Are you going to do your best for Jesus? You're off to a great start. So let's do our best on our paper as well. Take out your blue crayon. Blue crayon, check. Don't forget that helper hand. It's there to help you. So put it right on your paper. Mommy and Daddy are holding on tight. What does Daddy say? What does Mommy say? And what do the babies say? Now, remember, we're not just saying words. We have to make sure they are all doing their jobs. So check that mommy and daddy are on your crayon. Check that those babies are in the buckle and they're buckled up tight in the back seat. And go ahead and color your pilgrim's jacket. Why did the pilgrims come from England? What were they wanting to do? Let's see who I could call on. Johanna, why did they want to leave England and come to America? 
Because there was a bad king and he wouldn't believe in God. That's right. He didn't believe in God. And so he didn't want them to, to pray and talk to God and read the Bible the way that God wanted us to. And so they wanted to come to America where they were free to learn about God. That's right. Good job, Johanna. And so they did. They came over in that big ship. And then when they came over, they landed in America. And then who helped the pilgrims that first year? The Indians. The Indians did. They did. They came and they helped them. And they were so kind to the pilgrims and showed them how to hunt and how to, to plant food like corn so that they could eat that first year. So they learned how to do all those things because they didn't have grocery stores, did they? They didn't have grocery stores. Now, do you see that thing that's in the, his hand? What do you think that's called? What is that? Axe. It is, it's an ax, it's a special tool. And what do you think they use that ax for? To cut down what? Trees. Mm -hmm, to cut down trees because now you could go to the store, they have special stores where you can buy things like materials that you would buy, like wood and hammer and nails, but they didn't have that when first, when they came to America, they didn't have those kind of stores, so they had to cut down their own trees to build their houses. Now, I see that he has a pair of knickers on or his pants. What color are those, Jonathan? Um, gray. Well, they are or black, but we're gonna make them look a little bit gray, so I'm not gonna color real hard. I'm just gonna color just like this, real lightly so that I can still see that he has a pair of pants on. And I'm doing such a good job, I'm staying inside those black lines. Go ahead and take out your black crayon and color inside those black lines to color his pants of our pilgrim. Mm -hmm. Good job. You're doing great. Keep it up. Carter, take out your black crayon now and color your, the pants black. I see some beautiful coloring. You're doing such a good job. We're off to a great start this morning. I like this hard work. How are you doing, boys and girls watching? Are you staying inside those lines, doing your very best on your pilgrim? I hope so. Very nice. I like how... Johanna is waiting so patiently for the teacher. Good job. Look at these nice papers right here. Wow. Table one. Hold up your paper and show your friends. Look what they're doing. Aren't they doing a good job? Hold it up so they can see it. Oh, Oakley, yours is upside down. Can you turn it the right way so your friends can see it? Nice job. All right, you may put your paper down. Very nice. I like it. Let's see over here. Looking nice. This table, hold up your paper and let's show your friends. Very nice. Love it. Good job. All right, close up your crayon boxes. Put them inside your desk. Boys and girls watching, let me see your papers. Very nice. Wow, you are off to a great start, too. I am very proud of you. All right, slide your papers inside your desk. Class, Dan, turn your chair to the front. What is this little boy that we just colored? What was he? He was a pilgrim. a pilgrim. That's right. Well, boys and girls watching, you are off to a great start. Let's keep working hard today, and let's have a great day.